The drying of rice seeds, especially during the Boro rainy season, is a major problem for Bangladeshi farmers. Frequently, bad weather comes during the harvesting period. Farmers face great difficulties with drying their paddy and seeds because of the storms and rain. As a result, seed quality deteriorates and no one can expect good yields by using poor quality seed. Seed dryness can easily be measured using a moisture meter. But there is a God-given way that farmers can use. By using their teeth, they can easily test and measure seed dryness. Care must be taken during seed drying. Farmers in Bangladesh generally dry seed on the ground. This means that right after threshing, the seed quality starts to deteriorate at the very beginning. Why? Well, for one thing, seed absorbs moisture from the soil, and this hampers the drying process. Also, soil particles, dust, and bits of plant will mix with the seed, and this will also deteriorate the seed quality. The women will be working all day drying the seed, and watching out that children, chickens, and other animals don't go on the seed. And finally, there's a high possibility of different varieties mixing. So let's listen to some of the experiences of the farmers of Maria village, who've worked on some innovative techniques for solving the problem by themselves. Now, they're no longer worried about drying seed, even during the rainy season. We've discovered the technique of making bamboo tables. My son, my husband and I made our table together. My wife and I discussed the idea. My wife knows how to make a thatch top for the table. So we were able to make it between us. There was hardly any cost involved. Everything was from our homestead, except a few nails and some jute rope. It was a very easy task. By drying the seeds on the table, we no longer have dirty seeds. And whenever there's rain, we can take our seeds under cover very quickly, so they don't get wet. Before, we were facing an enormous problem, drying our seeds during the rainy season. But we now know that even inside the house, the seeds can become dry. When they're on the table, it's the wind that helps in drying. Now that we dry our seeds on the table, it means that chickens, goats and other animals can't reach the seeds. We use the table to dry fishes, flour and other things. Others sometimes use it as a relaxing bed or as a storage table. Now we dry our seeds on the table. Chickens, goats and other animals can't reach the seeds. The table helps us a lot to give us good quality seed. Now we don't need to borrow seed from other farmers like we used to. So what have we learned from the farmers of Maria village? We've learned that we need to solve problems for ourselves. 
Proper drying is necessary for giving good quality seed. Drying seeds on the ground deteriorates quality. A drying table has many other uses than just drying rice seed. So we must remember that well-dried seed is good seed.